Into that frame's gonna back up now. And what about all these? No, they're always on. Uh, I, I could probably put a switch on it if I wanted to, but I uh, just went ahead and had it on as part of the system. Now, my town lights I can turn on and off. And so we built a winery, and that is the RC winery that you see in that purple building right there. And what I have is that in the back, it's an open. And so the barrels vibrate and they go uh, release into the bottom and the back end of the building. So that doesn't do me any good if it's right in the middle. So I had to figure out, okay, how can I get these barrels so I can put it back on again? Well, I devised a system that I just got PVC pipe that's running. And if you look right here by the stand, right here is where they come out. Uh, the barrels come out. So we're going to see if that will work. All right, who's my, who's my help? Come on. All right, I need you to press that button right there. Barrel post, we'll see if it'll work. Max brought his engine over. It's a, almost like my original 1954 engine. It's a uh, Pennsylvania Railroad uh, um, turbine engine. And uh, let's put him on here for right now. Let's see. Let's have him go this way. <coughs> with the uh, with the electronic systems that they have today, you, you know how to put it on there. Um, you can add engines to your remote and uh, be able to control them by the. Uh, this particular remote is a DCS remote. Uh, Lionel makes remotes also. Uh, I chose uh, the MTH system because you can control both. Lionel and MTH with it and any other uh, system.